like it's night here right now and it's you know it's middle of the morning uh, it's overcast and it's raining is what I'm saying okay uh, rejuvenating in July oh yeah I'm, I'm on vacation uh, lining up the ducks for August 24th release of the new solo album this side or the other look for a new website launch look for a new website launch five four three go one, lift off! Uh, look for website launch very soon where you can pre-order the album and other offerings. Uh, live performance is coming up Pearl Street Warehouse in Washington, D.C. Empire State Railway Museum in Phoenicia, New York. Oh, that sounds great. Uh, Possum Hollow Log Cabin Concerts in St. Paris, Ohio. Uh, you know, I mean, how cool is that? Possum Hollow Log Cabin Concerts, okay, funky, in St. Paris, you know, sublime, Ohio, in the middle. Okay. Uh, Natalie's in the greater Columbus area, Ohio area. The greater Columbus area. I'm not messing with those other lesser areas in uh, Columbus. Uh, Labor Day weekend album release show in Nashville. We've got to get the band together. Uh, Europe and more. <laughs> First we take Europe, then more. Uh, you know, more, John Hadley, on this. If you just say more and more and more over and over and over again, more and more and more and more, more, it ends up being warm. More and 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 more. Hear it? Would I lie to you? Okay. Tickets now on sale. All thanks David Only online at davidonly.com. Okay, let's do another uh, mockingbird poem from R.B. Morris. Uh, just random here. And Mockingbird sang. It was a beautiful lost summer day. Everything was full of itself, and nothing more than Mockingbird. And not a soul knew why or what had wrought its creation or cared to think, and no one less than Mockingbird. He played with the wind. He played with the chimes. He was the wind in chimes. And when the sun had reached its zenith, Mockingbird sang out echoing a grove of willows, God's own horn tuning the sky. Let's get this going, said God. Let's get this going, said Mockingbird. And every bird that heard was heard to sing, Wonder, 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 a chorus of wonder. And the trees chimed in, What world it is, what world it is. And all the grasses played golden harps. Amen, said Mockingbird. Let's begin, said Mockingbird. World without end, said Mockingbird. World without end. Yeah. Okay. So, I wanted to do something from Dutchman's Curve. Uh, from whenever. From 2010. And, uh... Dutchman's Curve was where the big train wreck was. This uh, Judy uh, Julie Sola's uh, etching of the uh, it's a famous photograph of the train wreck in Nashville, Tennessee, and uh, there it is. Anyway, this song is on is on there, and the reason I want to do this it's the theme song that you never know. Oh, look at that ring. Okay. Uh, but the concept in my head behind this is uh, minimalist guitar parts. And I'll do another one next week. But this one, uh, is, there's, there's almost no, they're guitar parts that if you did anything less, 
there wouldn't be a guitar part. Just cause she smiles Don't mean she likes you Just cause she growls She'll bite. Yeah, she's wild. But is she psycho? You never know. You never know. Is she for real? Is she just playing? A rumor? Is she a fact? Is she smoke? Smoke and mirrors. You never know. You never know. your mind well now she's in there all the time you never know till you scratch that itch and walk across that burning bridge you never know you never know Let it get inside your mind well, Now she's in there all the time You never know till you scratch that itch And uh, stroll across that burning bridge Is she the cure? The doctor ordered For the fever Is this Paris? Or is this Newark? You never know. You never know. You never know. You never know, and the reason it's a min minimal guitar part, I just use the bottom three strings. So the uh, top three strings, they can go on vacation, maybe write a book. Uh, I always thought, when I was uh, very young, uh, Dwayne Eddy guitar songs, Rebel Rouser and those things were on the radio. and. Uh, I mean, they weren't flashy playing. It was just like, bow, 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 bow. You know, they're just single notes. It wasn't like, uh, you know, Jimi Hendrix or, you know, Jeff Beck or something like that. It was very simple playing. But it sounded great. Oh, the tone on the guitar was killer. And so a guitar or, or a violin or flute or anything, they don't have to be played, you know, at top speed, virtuosity and all that stuff. They sound cool when you just go toot on them. And uh, I'll tell you who figured that one out is Miles Davis. And that's Miles Davis right now. Can you hear Miles uh, giving his approval, I hope, for what I'm saying. All right, hope I got your approval too and uh, I'll see you next week. Or you never know.
coming on 